keeping it real. And I'm here to do a makeup tutorial. So y'all know how I put on my makeup. Okay, so now I'm going to start with my foundation. And this is Hermé. It's the foundation I use. Very good foundation. I already took my shower. I cleaned my face. on. I don't put too much on. It's very hot, so I don't really wear makeup in the summer. Don't really wear it unless I'm really going out somewhere important, like doctors and stuff like that, or if I just want to feel pretty for the day, I put some makeup on. Sometimes I put the whole shebang, like the foundation and stuff, like I'm doing now. But I'm doing this, so. I can show you guys how I do my makeup because I've been doing my makeup since I was 18 years old. So everybody does their makeup different and everybody puts their makeup on different. So it's no right or wrong way to put your makeup on. You're your own individual person. So I don't care if makeup on. They say, oh no, you're putting it on wrong. It's how you want to put your makeup on. You know? So you really don't need nobody to teach you how to put your makeup on. You put it on how you so feel, how you choose. So I've been doing my makeup since I was 18. I don't have to be a makeup artist to put my makeup on. It's all common sense. The colors to match your skin, your eyes, your clothing, you know, the type of lipstick you want to wear. Wear any kind of colors, bold, you know, soft color, heavy color, whatever, how you feel for that day. Whatever kind of makeup you want to feel, you go for it. It's you. Nobody got to look at it. If they don't like it, don't look at it. Plain and simple, period. Straight like that. And I wear my makeup, my clothing, put chandelier, nobody else. How I feel for that day. My makeup on. To suit me. And like I said, sometimes I don't want to wear makeup, so I don't. This just enhances my beauty. This enhances it. That's it. Because I don't really like to wear it because it be so hot. <laughs> Makes me hot. That's why I don't really wear my hair. My hair is past my shoulders. See, this bump curl. <laughs> See, my hair is very tricky. You know, it's very curly and wavy. So, if my hair curls real, real tight up, when I do wear it out, it's real tight up. Really, really tight. I got hair, it's just very curly. That's the Cherokee Indian in me. Very curly and wavy. And everybody wish they had this kind of hair. I wish I didn't because sometimes I like to wear it out and it won't. And I don't really like to be flat ironing it and straighten it out too much. Unless I'm going somewhere, then I flat iron and straighten it out. And I do that myself too. Went a couple of times to get it straightened out, but now I know how to do it myself. I do me and my daughter's hair. Okay, now I'm gonna put the black on. And this here is L A G. This is L A color. This on. So I can finish this. I'm gonna try to finish my. Make a tutorial for you guys so y'all can see how I put on my makeup. Okay. Hope everybody's having a blessed day. Because I am. We all woke up this morning, so that's a blessing in itself. Everybody stay safe. Out there. Okay, now I'm putting on the, the black. Because I'm wearing black today. Now. 
put a hint of gray in. It's only how you want to wear your makeup. Like I said, don't let nobody tell you how to wear your makeup. It's how you feel for that day. Like I said, it's only common sense on putting your makeup on. How you feel that day. Because I put my makeup on to match my skin, my clothes, my accessories that I have on. For that day. This is what I'm doing. Because everybody's different. Everybody got different skin texture, so. Everybody's unique in their own way. Back now, I'm going to put my highlights on that I bought. Okay. Now, these are from who? Don't say, right? Yeah, this is the highlight panel. Brand new, taking it out. See, these are all the different highlights. So, we got Glam, Glitz, and we got Glam, Glam, Glam and we got Golden and Glamour. Mm -hmm. So, let me see which one I'm going to use. Let me see how I'm open this. Can I, oh, yeah, how it go? This. Just peel this off. Goodness. They don't want you to even get in the makeup even after you pay for it. <laughs> Gee. Stuff on here. You need all that. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use this. One. I know you use that one. Right? Yeah. I'm gonna use this one. Let me get my makeup, my mirror, so I can see. Oh uh, yeah, I like this. Yeah, we about to put this on different, so I stroke up. <laughs> I did go to cosmetology, though. To cosmetology, I took small engines, I took horticulture. And who don't know what that is, I tell you, that's working with flowers. Small engines for cars. Cosmetology, see, that's makeup. And close a cute little case. You got the little highlights on now. Put an eyeliner. I use the liquid eyeliner. I like this. Also like you know the pencil too, but I like the liquid a lot. I've been using that since my two kids were small. I discovered this, I said yes. See with this here you gotta be careful because this will get in the eyes. So I gotta make sure. And just to get the excess off. Make sure that it don't run. You don't want it running all over your face. You just want it to dry nice and evenly. See, that's how I do it, y'all. Sometimes I just be in the house, just want to get dressed, just to feel good about myself. And we can do that, you know, make ourselves feel good. That's where my kids get all their dressing from, from me. It starts with the root, and the root is me. That's why they know how to dress the way they do. 
And plus, we come from a dresser family anyway. Everybody in my family. Cousins, aunts, uncles, grandparents, cousins, all of us know how to dress. That we do. We're very fashionable people. Yeah, we're very fashionable when it calls for it. Dress up, dress down, dress casual. Even had the makeup going on with it, too. I love my makeup. I've always been a fashionista or diva. Always classy. Because all the women in my family are very classy. We're very classy and sophisticated women in our family. All of us. My aunts, female cousins. We all sophisticated. Sophisticated and classy we are. We're not stuck up and conceited people though. But we know who we are. Nobody can take that away from us. We know who we are and nobody can ever take that away from us. I know who I am. I can't take that away. I'm a very classy, sophisticated woman. Always been. Since a teenager, always been. When you find yourself and know who you are, nobody can take that away from you. And I know I'm a classy, sophisticated, glamorous diva. I'm gorgeous from the inside out. I know who I am. I'm a very good person to everybody I come in contact with. And I'm rich in the Lord. I'm, I'm blessed. Now, I got that on. But you want to make sure that it's even. When you do put this on, and always have your tissue, because it will try and run off. Like I said, I'm doing this tutorial for you guys to let y'all know how I do my makeup. Like I said, everybody do their makeup different, you know. It's all how you feel. So you see how I got it. I did the little cat. I like that. Sometimes I do them long like that. And then sometimes I do them small. And just be creative with your makeup, you know. Yeah, I like playing your makeup. My daughter, she wears her makeup. And I taught her how to put it on. And then she's being creative, so she's teaching herself as well. I taught her how I wear mines. So she wears mines, like I wear mines, and she wears hers, like she wears hers. So she's teaching herself how to be more creative, too, with her makeup and colors and stuff, you know? That's how we do. We play in the different color makeups, you know? It's all in learning, because you're never too old to learn things. Never too long to, to learn anything in this world. Learn something every day. Because everybody don't know it all, but some people think they do, and they don't. No, you got to bring, you're still teachable. Don't care how, how old you get. Okay. Now, see how I got that, y'all? And see, I got my little highlight going on. On my face. And now for the, um, the mascara. Okay. Okay, this is butterfly butterfly volume. This is butterfly volume. I don't know if y'all can see it. Right there. And this is really good. See, because this is the way it is. How it's shaped. Okay, let me get my mirror here. The mascara. Ain't gonna put too much on. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to show y'all how I do mine. And I'm about to put on my 
lipstick. I'm going to do all my makeup. I'm about to put on my lipstick and I'm done. Put gray. Like I said, put on what you feel. Like how you feeling for that day. Like for me, and it's just my opinion. There's no wrong or right way to put makeup on. That's my opinion. And that's great outline I got around my lips. See, I put my makeup on how I feel because I could do that. Because I got the gray outline and then I got gray eyeshadow. I've completed my makeup and if you want you can put Vaseline to make the lipstick shine if you got dull lipstick because sometimes I get some dull lipstick or some that's already got the shine so I just put this on and I got lip gloss too it's up until it's up in my makeup stuff see finished with my makeup as y'all can see I got the highlights I got the lip lipstick the eyeliner the lip liner the eyeshadow and the gray is matching the gray lip liner and my black eyeliner. And then I got the little cat eyes going on. So I will be doing another uh, makeup tutorial. This is how I put on my makeup and make myself feel good when I want to dress up and play in the makeup with me and my daughter Precious. And everybody have a good blessed day and I hope that y'all like my makeup. You see, get a good look. Look at the makeup. I think I did a good job, y'all. Yes. So thank y'all for tuning in. Okay, this is Chandelier Keeping It Real. And I love you guys. And God bless y'all. And have a beautiful, blessed weekend. Bye.